In recent years, Turkey has made remarkable strides in developing indigenous missile technology for its navy. Turkey is building a layered, integrated, and modern missile force that reflects its strategic ambitions and technological maturity. The sophistication of its latest naval missiles is evident in three interrelated domains anti-ship strike, submarine launch missiles, and point defense. The core of Turkey's naval strike capability is the rockets and made Atmaga anti-ship cruise missile, a long-range, precision-guided weapon that has become the backbone of its surface-to-surface -surface anti ship force. Its development marked a strategic leap, enabling submarines to engage surface targets from submerged positions, enhancing stealth and flexibility. Guidance and navigation. The missile uses a combination of inertial navigation, GPS, barometric altimeter, and radar altimeter to reach its target. An active radar seeker enables precise terminal guidance. It supports mid-course updates, retargeting, ray attack, and mission abort via a two-way data link. The Atmica has a range of over 120 kilometers, carries a high explosive penetrator warhead approximately 150 kilograms, and weighs less than 800 kilograms. Further enhancing Turkey's capabilities is its submarine launch variant, known as the Sub Atmica. In March 2025, the Turkish Navy successfully tested this version of the Prevez class TCG Prevez launching it from a 533mm torpedo tube housed in a watertight capsule. This capability places Turkey in a relatively exclusive group. Only a few countries possess domestically produced anti-ship cruise missiles that can be launched from submarines, while the Atmica and Akata represent offensive power. Turkey's defensive sophistication is also noteworthy. To key systems stand out, the Geekser and the Levant. These systems utilize an infrared imaging seeker plus a two-way encrypted data link. For mid-flight updates. By relying on domestically developed missiles, Turkey reduces its reliance on foreign systems such as the Harpoon and strengthens its defense industrial base. With the Atmica, Akata, the Turkish Navy now has significant anti-ship range, enabling both surface ships and submarines to project power. The submarine-launched Atmica enhances the element of surprise and survivability. The Geekser and Levent provide a multi-layered defense shield. The Geekser addresses medium to short-range air threats with AI-based target management, while the Levent provides rapid, last-minute interception. The Midless Vertical Launching System VLS supports this integration. It has been used to fire missiles such as the Hassar D and is designed to support the Atmica and other naval munitions. New Turkish warships, such as the upcoming TF-000 destroyer are planned to carry a large VLS-96 cells, enabling a combination of offensive and defensive missiles. The sophistication of this missile system enhances Turkey's maritime deterrence capabilities, especially in contested seas like the Mediterranean and Black Seas. Having a modern, indigenous missile strengthens its military's bargaining power and credibility. While tests like the sub Atmica launch and the Geekser interception are promising, sustained operational deployment requires further testing, integration, and possibly increase production. Turkish defense companies can market this system abroad, but export deals require the ability to navigate geopolitical constraints and competitive defense markets. As missile threats evolve, adversaries will also develop sophisticated countermeasures. Continuous R&D is necessary to keep guidance, seekers, and data links ahead of the threat. To fully utilize this missile system, Turkey must continue to modernize its fleet from corvettes and frigates to submarines ensuring that its combat management systems, radars, and VLS are up dash to dash date. Turkey single quotes S newest missiles mounted on warships represent a leap forward in naval sophistication. The country not only builds powerful offensive weapons like the Atmica and Akata, but also world-class defense systems like the Geekser and Levent. Together, these systems enable a balanced approach, attacking from the sea or beneath it while protecting assets from air threats. This growing indigenous missile ecosystem underscores Turkey's ambition to become a self-sufficient maritime power. It strengthens its security posture and expands its influence in regional geopolitics, while demonstrating its rapidly growing defense industrial base. base.